Dubai Robot Exhibition. Hold up, wait a second, did you already subscribe? If not, please do so, so we can make more and better content for you. Gitex Global kicked out on Monday, October 10th with all things technologically chic. Packed with flying cars, autonomous vehicles and new technologies, the expo has been drawing headlines across the region. Gitex Global is an acronym for Gitex Global. The presence of many robots during the entirety of the event that is being held at the Dubai World Trade Center has been one of the more fascinating aspects that have been on the show. The College Times has compiled a list of the most exciting robots to look out for shortly. These robots range from humanoid robots to life-sized interactive ones. Curious to know more? Now let's get deeper into this. Alicia. Since the beginning of Gitex, everyone has been discussing the AI-powered robot on display at the exhibit. Alicia is quite the crowd puller since she is talkative and engaged. She draws people in by answering inquiries and making snarky comments. For instance, when a random person walked up to her and asked if he could snap a selfie, her response was, yes, I would appreciate that. Autobot. This autonomous robot can bring you food, groceries, and other requirements. Because of its one-of-a-kind modular design, the Autobot has already been implemented at several airports and shopping malls worldwide. To access their parcels and remove them from the cubicle, receivers must present either a one-of-a-kind QR code or an OTP. Businesses can rent delivery robots on a subscription basis and custom constructs them with the capability of adding refrigeration or heating to maintain the appropriate temperature for food and drink. This food and duty-free delivery robot has become rather popular at airports in Cincinnati and Rome, serving travelers waiting in line for their purchases. Swiss Smile the Swiss Smile is a multi-purpose robot driven by 16 motors and cameras and can control and change the shape of its legs using an engine. The people who developed it claim that it has applications in monitoring and making deliveries in the final mile. This comparison on four legs can travel up to 20 km per hour, making it possible to traverse even the roughest terrain. In humanoid form, it can stand up on its own two legs and it has the potential for application in commercial surveillance large-scale building inspections, and search and rescue operations. It has a maximum carrying capacity of 100 kilograms and can be used for delivery in the final mile. In addition, it is waterproof to a depth of 1 meter and has a battery life of up to 10 hours. The price of the robot is approximately 200,000 US dollars. Marco Bielonik, who works at Swiss Mile and is based at Zurich, claimed that the technology is ideal in a circumstance where you would not want to send a human, such as a structure that is on fire or that is unstable. We are working on autonomy to allow it to climb anywhere and travel from point A to point B without being directed where to go. The Humanoid Creature This humanoid robot at the Ian Booth can engage in conversation with attendees thanks to its disguise as a construction worker. Its eyes and face give it a far more human appearance than the other robots, and it can be utilized for various reasons, like directing people through airports and shopping malls. Mini Robot This little robot, which the Technology Innovation Institute developed, can be guided by remote control and can observe people to identify potential hazards in the workplace. It is intended for use in manufacturing facilities and warehouses, both for stocking purposes and in situations where it is necessary to identify individuals who have sustained injuries. Caesar. Caesar was created to take the role of a human receptionist and comes equipped with a camera to assist those working in the control center in identifying incoming guests. Even when you speak to him through a microphone, he can deliver a certain amount of responses to your questions. This is it everyone, so what do you think? Leave a comment and let us know. Thank you for watching the video, don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already done that. Also put on the notifications because the following video is going to be a great one.